All right, down and dirty, we want to import some of these default song sounds into or songs into our set list. So I'm going to show you how to do it. Right now, we're working with the local knowledge set list. It has our list of songs that we do already, but I want to add the funk beat, funk number, funk number seven. Okay, so here's how we do it. We select funk seven. Okay, you go to the top to file. Roll down to export because we're exporting this out of here and then we're going to have to import it back. But export song, Funk 7 Swung. All right, and that's putting this in a folder. Uh, if you look here, see, I just click this to see the long path. But this is under, I keep mine in the C drive, users, Rob, documents, BB workspace, user line projects. And the very last, so it's basically in your project folder under songs. That's where these are going to go. Okay, so just save it there. All right, next thing you need to do is you need to go up to the top and click the set list. Because we're going to take this song we just exported and we're going to import it into our set list. So back to file, the top, back down to import this time, song. Scroll down, we're in the exact same folder. Scroll down to Funk 7 Swung Song. All right, there we go. So click that bad boy. I'm going to open it up. Now you're going to see it on the set list. At this point, you're like, I don't want to be named that. I want to be named what this song is going to be. So if you click it one time there, it'll give you this little window and you can rename it. Renamed. All right. At that point, you can you know, see it down here. You can work with it. You can take it and you can move it somewhere else in your set list. If you do want to delete it, see how this is in blue here. This is the renamed one we just did. If you go all the way over to the right, there's an X. You can click that. Yes, we want to delete this song. Bye-bye. The end.